Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be checking out Super Toy Cars, because I'm sick of life. <laughs> I'm sick of having to go to work every day and work two jobs. I want to go back and roll back the clocks to when I was a kid, and I used to play with little Hot Wheels cars and race them and, and do the cool track things and tape them to the wall and stuff. I want to do that today. So we're going to be playing Eclipse Games, Eclipse, Eclipse Games, Eclipse Game Studios game. <laughs> to, uh, super toy cars uh, we're gonna hop into I already did career mode a bunch and I kind of like it but there's a lot going on there's a lot of different um, let me see if we can just quit what happens when we quick race okay so there are so many different kinds of races in this game which I like it, it's like the tabletop simulator of racing games which I like a lot but when you go into career mode they throw so many of them at you so quickly I'm like wait a minute whoa whoa what's up whoa, that's crazy but there's a bunch to show off here so uh, I think what I'll do is I also feel like some of them are the same kind of like i feel like so so race is a normal race you run you run around you get items you can whip them to people you can destroy cars stuff like that clean race can't do any of that i don't think i think you can like knock you can like blow up other cars but there's like no items it's a clean race it's as if you were playing like a more realistic um racing game like uh gran turismo or something like that i know you can crash gran turismo but you know what i'm talking about um death race where the point of the race is to actually knock out as many people as you can elimination is over time people in last place get taken out of the race time trial obviously it's to see how fast you can get through the tracks destruction is you as a character are trying to take out these little like you can see in the little picture over there you can see the little buggy guy that guy the the, the taxi the the, ta the dump the dummy taxi buggy things that they'll spawn on the map and you can take out as many as you can in a certain amount of time and demolition derby is when you get thrown into an arena and you have to get you have to destroy shit um and i'm gonna be honest with you i like a lot of these and i hate and i and i i dislike some of them but i'm not gonna tell you which ones we're gonna play through we're gonna play through a regular race uh just to see what the base game looks like um ooh. oh i get to choose i haven't done the fire and smoke one let's do that fire smoke and suburban actually it might have actually i don't know but this is a two-player game. If you are at home and you have somebody that you want to play with, they can join in with you. Uh, it has local co-op. I believe this online. I don't know if that's really loud. I can't tell if it's really loud or not. The controls on the on the game is pretty good. I like I like the uh, the control I have over the car, which is nice. Um, the items they have available are pretty cool. Not gonna lie. I'm not against them the controls are different though because so i'm holding my i'm holding my right trigger to go there is a drift function in the game you have to hold b on the xbox controller to do it um oh, my ice sure. core cobs uh lightning though i think the lightning turns off other people's cars so you can smash into them i think is what it does i'm almost certain at this point see it just slowed me down so he can get past it's a really big AOE movement. It's strange. It's interesting. But there is a drifting function, which feels a little bit different than Mario Kart. But I like it because it fits the realistic looking cars. Like, yeah, I get it. We're playing this. We're playing little toy Hot Wheel cars. But like, it feels it feels pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Also, I get to play as a buggy, and you can see the guy in front of me has the uh, the old hippie car, the old hippie bus. I love that. I love that. There's a bunch of wacky cars to play as. You can play as more serious looking cars. Um, the, the maps are really cool. Again, like this this feels like Tabletop Simulator, but with, with little Hot Wheels cars. It's the best way I can explain it, because all the tracks all look like this, where they're kind of just pieces of, you know, we picked Backyard Smokestack, I think it was, right? So there's a lot of barbecue things floating around, like wiener, do wiener dogs and lemons and limes and kebabs, uh, tables, corn. We have hot coals flying everywhere. Like, it's dangerous, man. It's dangerous for a toy car out here. I do like that when you do bounce off a wall, because it just happened, it just reminded me. When you do bounce off a wall, it does auto-correct you a little bit, which is kind of neat. Oh, I want to hit this guy. Go. Oh, he was just targeting a second ago. Uh, play that back. A few seconds ago, he was red. He was highlighted in a red. This missile was aiming right for him. But then I must have turned, and you might, they must need to be in your sights in order for that to work. I still don't know how they do that one. Ooh. Up. Oh, and I got smashed by corn. Oh, I think the, that's the one drawback of the magnet. That's the one drawback of the magnet. If you pick up a really big item, you can't see in front of you. Uh, I kind of wish that it picked up the item and kind of put it out of your sight behind you. Like when you were moving, it would like it would flow behind you like a like a flag. If that makes any sense. Also, we're gonna lose this race. There's no way. Oh, oh, that was a big bump. I do like that cars have health in this game, and I only know that because there's an item in the game that's 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 a health item. Like you can you can heal your car the damage on your car which is kind of wild 
So we're gonna get, we're gonna get a red one. I remember doing one of my first races with this too when I first loaded it up, uh, and I was able to do a flip off of the off of one of the ramps. Haven't been able to do it since. Don't know what that's about. Wish I could do that again. Uh, I don't think it gave me a speed boost necessarily, but maybe it's because I was going a certain amount of speed off of the ramp, and it, it, it led me to do that. I don't really know. I'm real with you. I also kind of like that there's no uh, speed meter. Is that what it's called? Th thermometer? Not thermometer. Pedometer? Pedometer. That's the word. So I don't need to know. Like, I don't know how fast I'm going, but, like, the speed of... I don't know, man. It feels really good. It, the, 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 there's so little on the screen, but the game feels fun to play. I'm going to do... Let's do... Let's show off a death race. Let's do that. Let's show off a death race. Let's go to... We just did backyard track? No, we did smoke, fire smoke, and burgers. Let's do... Yeah, let's do the sleepover track. All right. I did buy a couple of cars because some of the some of the career mode uh some of the career mode stuff makes you specifically have to have a specific car so i was like oh, i'll buy one of each one of each type and uh yeah oh here we go look at this death death race works like a normal race but with power-ups and the number of laps to complete but with the inconvenience that you have to that if you're destroyed the race is over for you in the death race it is just as important to be as fast as it is tough choose your play style and smash your opponents and leave them behind it's your choice let's do it baby I like the police paint job on this guy. <clears throat> Ooh. That's fine. That's fine. We're going forward. Can I shoot that guy? Ooh! Oh, I can't get destroyed. If I get destroyed, that's it. It's over. <clears throat> I am in fifth place, though. I don't think I've played on this map yet. Like, I could be wrong, but I don't think I've played on this map yet. I want to catch up with this lightning bolt. Like I got the lightning bolt in one of my one of, one of the first races that I played this in. I got the I got the lightning bolt and I was like, oh, did they just pull this from? Did they just pull this from uh, Mario or did they make it uh, make it interesting? Also, this is the I know what this track is. I was just I was like, dude, this track seems so familiar. And now I realize why it does. It's because it's the it, it's the toy track but backwards. I love that. That's it. I'm eliminated. I'm eliminated. I can restart though, so I want to try doing that. Let's restart. Now that I know what this is about. I also like that there isn't no like early boost thing. Like, oh, for Mario Kart, they were. Oh. All right. He he really. What? Can I get a restart? There's no restart button. Oh, bad times. Oh, there goes the hood of my car! Incredible. Alright, wait. Alright, hold on. I can't move blocks with the electric thingy. Okay, I'm just curious. Like, I thought maybe it was a pulse that, like... Oh, I can heal, though? The heal item is in this mode, too? That's interesting. Ooh! My screen was going gray. Nice, he got drawn up, but I did not... Ooh, the eight ball? No, that's too powerful. I don't think I got anybody with that. Woo! I also don't like that the, the item button is the A button. It just it it's not that it doesn't make sense. It's really hard to hit, especially while I'm trying to drift. I, I wish the item button was on one of the bumpers or something like that. Woof! All right, I think we can. We can I was gonna say grind. We can drift this whole part. Yeah, we can. All right, we still got a whole another lap after this. Jeez. Oh, okay, so the, my, my favorite item in the game is this spring item. You drop the spring, and if somebody lands on the spring, it makes them do a little flip on their car, which is great. No, go forward. I got a shield. Great. I'm holding B for some reason too much. Oh, I thought he was going to smash into it. He did not. He said, I don't care for that. I got a ball. Man, the eight ball is, like, really good. I like the eight ball because it's real. He just took both those items. You just took both those items, bro. That's not fair. I'll watch him have a spring, though. The spring is, I, I feel like I can only compare the spring to the to the banana peel of Mario Kart. Because I feel like if I was to land on it, that's what it would feel like. I haven't landed on one yet. Oh, I hate the magnet. There's also no way to drop items. Oh, I won! Oh, shoot! Cool! We did it! I didn't expect to win! 
That was cool. All right. Well, let's do one more race. Let's do one more race. Let's do a demolition derby to close out the video. Let's see. What do we, what do we want to go? Uh, the grinder. Oh, there's only two. All right. Let's do the barbecue havoc. I might have not have unlocked the rest of them if there's more. I don't know if there's more demolition derby areas. How many? How many can you have? You know, that's a really that's a real picture right there. All right. So demolition derby is the, like it's it makes sense. You're just gonna go in. You gotta grab power ups. You gotta knock people out and do it as many times as you like. You gotta knock out as many people as you possibly can without. Also, without taking yourself out. Nice. Can you heal. Beautiful. Oh, I got him. Snipe with the eight ball. Beautiful. I'm going to heal too. All right. Great, great, great. I don't see anybody. I see them on the map, but I don't, like, see them. It's. I feel like it's much harder to see. So, like, what I would like to see with this game in the future, if possible is like maybe even in a further update they can like put silhouettes maybe silhouettes on them or something like that or like little thingies above their heads so i can see where the cars are when i turn like it's kind of hard to pick them up i wear glasses so like it's it's a little hard to pick them up sometimes when like that guy just barely saw that guy also they're gonna give me some more they're gonna give me some cool demolition items because i couldn't see that guy coming from a mile away Okay, I got rocketed as soon as it came into the map. All right, and then I'm out. I'm dead. I, didn't, I wasn't. I wasn't speeding enough. Incredible. I don't know what the strategy is for demolition. I don't know what the strategy is at all. Cause I'll get an item. I'll pop it. Right. The rockets don't seem to kill. It's a little hard to target. Got him right there. Yeah, baby. I'm getting a lot of shields too. I kind of wish shields weren't a thing in this mode. Uh, they took out shields and healing so that people couldn't, you know, do that. Oh, I think I just got hit by an electric attack. Oops, oops, just big oops is everywhere. How long do those balls stay on the map too? Is a very good question. I would like to know that. Like, is it worth just throwing them in any random direction? Or should I bounce them off a wall? Like, what's the what's the strat here? Oh, I was in fourth place. I didn't even, I wasn't even paying attention to the timer. The timer was behind me. You guys didn't see it. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed the video and you want to see some more indie content, head over to twitch.tv slash rules and watch me there live. But also, just, you know, hit subscribe on the channel. Why not? It's a fun little channel. You get to check out indie games all the time. Hell, if you enjoyed this game, let me know what your favorite car is. Leave a comment down below. Like the video if you can. I'll see you guys in the next video, though. Bye-bye. Now I'm the king of the swingers, oh, the jungle VIP. I've reached the top and had to stop and